Is the DJI NEO 2 about to change the drone game? Rumors and leaks have been circulating, and it looks like DJI is bringing some serious upgrades. From improved camera specs to enhanced flight performance, the NEO 2 could be a major leap forward for both professionals and hobbyists. But is it all good news? Let's break it down. What's exciting, what's concerning, and when we might finally see it hit the market. Let's talk about one of the most exciting parts, the camera. If leaks are accurate, the DJI NEO 2 will feature a 1-inch sensor with a 20 megapixel resolution, making it a huge step up from older models. A bigger sensor means it can capture more light, resulting in sharper details, better colors, and much stronger low-light performance. If you've ever struggled with grainy nighttime shots, this upgrade could make a big difference. But that's not all. It is rumored to support 5.4K video at 60 frames per second, making it a dream for filmmakers who want buttery smooth footage with high resolution. The addition of a 10-bit D-Log could allow for even better color grading, giving professionals the flexibility they need in post-production. Now, while this all sounds fantastic, there are still some unknowns. Will DJI include an adjustable aperture for more control over exposure? Will these advanced features be exclusive to a pro version, making them pricier? These are questions we need answers to before getting too excited. Still, if these rumors hold up, the NEO 2 could be a serious competitor in the aerial photography market. A great camera is only part of the equation. You also need a drone that flies well, and this is where the NEO 2 could really impress. According to leaks, it might hit 60 miles per hour, which is incredibly fast for a drone in this category. Speed is useful for capturing fast-moving subjects like cars, wildlife, or action sports without lag or blur. One of the most exciting upgrades could be battery life. Reports suggest the NEO 2 might last up to 40 minutes per charge, a big jump from previous models. If true, this could be a game changer. Longer flights mean more time to get the perfect shot without constantly swapping out batteries. Anyone who has used drones before knows how frustrating short flight times can be. The inclusion of OcuSync 4.0 is another interesting rumor. This would mean a more stable connection and a longer transmission range, reducing interference issues when flying in tricky environments. However, there are concerns. Will these upgrades make the drone bulkier? Will the longer flight time come with a heavier battery? and how will it handle extreme weather conditions? These performance upgrades sound promising, but real-world tests will tell us if they live up to expectations. For now, we can only speculate on how well the NEO 2 will handle the skies. Flying a drone should be easy and safe, and that's why obstacle avoidance is so important. If leaks are accurate, DJI is taking this seriously with the NEO 2. We're talking full direction obstacle sensors, meaning sensors on every side of the drone. If true, this would make it much harder to crash, even in tight spaces or busy environments. What's even more exciting is the rumored AI powered tracking. If the NEO 2 includes Active Track 5.0 and Point of Interest 4.0, tracking moving subjects could become smoother than ever. Imagine locking onto a subject and letting the drone follow them flawlessly without you needing to adjust constantly. This would be amazing for solo filmmakers, vloggers, and action sports enthusiasts. But AI-powered tracking isn't always perfect. We've seen previous DJI models struggle in low contrast or complex environments. Will the NEO 2 fix those issues? Will the tracking be reliable enough to use in unpredictable conditions like forests or crowded cities? These are the concerns we need to keep in mind. While smarter AI sounds great, it's only as good as its real-world performance. If DJI nails this, the NEO 2 could be one of the most user-friendly drones ever made. A drone's design plays a big role in how convenient it is to use. The NEO 2 is rumored to have a foldable design, 
which would make it much easier to carry around. If this is true, it means DJI is keeping portability in mind, much like they did with the Mavic series. For travelers and outdoor videographers, a compact drone is a must-have. There's also talk of a built-in touchscreen controller. If true, this could mean you won't need to attach your smartphone for live viewing and controls, making setup faster. This would be a big convenience for users who prefer an all-in-one controller without extra attachments. Connectivity upgrades could also be coming. Reports suggest support for Wi-Fi 6 and Bluetooth 5.3, allowing for faster and more stable connections. If DJI improves live streaming capabilities, users might be able to share footage directly to platforms like YouTube without hassle. But there are always trade-offs. Will the foldable design affect durability? Will the built-in touchscreen drain battery life faster? And if the controller is redesigned, will it still be as comfortable and functional as previous models? These are important factors that could make or break the Neo 2's portability and usability. While the DJI Neo 2 sounds too good, let's talk about the potential downsides. The first big concern is the price. With all these new features, will it be significantly more expensive than previous models? High-end drones already come with hefty price tags, and these upgrades could push it further out of reach for casual users. Another issue is software reliability. DJI's past AI features have been great, but not always perfect. Will the Neo 2's new tracking and obstacle avoidance work smoothly, or will they have occasional glitches? AI-driven drones sound great on paper, but real-world performance is what matters. Supply chain issues could also play a role in availability. DJI has faced production delays before, and if demand is high, getting your hands on one at launch might be difficult. Long wait times and stock shortages could frustrate potential buyers. At the end of the day, no drone is perfect. The Neo 2 has exciting possibilities, but we need to see how DJI balances these features with real-world practicality. So, when will the DJI Neo 2 be officially announced? Right now, DJI has not provided any official details, but many leaks and rumors suggest it could be hitting the market later this year. Looking at DJI's past product releases, they tend to announce new drones within the first half of the year, so a launch in the coming months wouldn't be too surprising. However, as with all leaks, we have to take this information with a bit of caution. While some details may turn out to be completely accurate, others might be exaggerated, changed, or even removed from the final product. It's not uncommon for companies to test multiple prototypes before deciding on the final version. Supply chain issues or unexpected delays could also push the launch further than expected. If you're eagerly waiting for this drone, it's best to stay tuned for DJI's official announcement. Until then, all we can do is speculate and hope that when it does arrive, it meets all the expectations set by these exciting leaks. The DJI Neo 2 has the potential to be a serious contender in the drone market. If the leaks about camera upgrades, longer battery life, improved AI tracking, and faster speeds turn out to be true, we could be looking at one of the most advanced drones of the year. Whether you're a professional filmmaker, an aerial photographer, or just someone who loves flying drones, these features sound truly exciting. But of course, we still have a lot of unanswered questions. Will the price be reasonable for most users? or will it be out of reach for hobbyists? And most importantly, will DJI actually deliver on all these exciting upgrades, or will some of them get cut before release? At this point, all we can do is wait and see. Until DJI makes an official announcement, everything remains speculation. But one thing is certain, this drone has sparked a lot of excitement and curiosity. So, that's all about the DJI Neo 2. Are you excited about the DJI Neo 2? Or do you have concerns about its potential downsides? Let us know your thoughts. As for everything else, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell icon if you want more content like this on your feed.